Hey YouTube, this is KSHI22 here and basically what I'm doing today is I'm going to teach you guys how to keep a forum at top most almost at 99% of all times. Now this is effective, very effective and I use this for a lot of things. But uh, this is the best way you can do it. So you're going to need your project open. I'm just going to create a new one, name it Project <laughs> Oh, well, project one, sorry. I need to clear out my temporary files, sorry. And basically what you're gonna want is a timer. Actually, you know what, yeah, I'll just go with this. It may be really slow. You're gonna want it true. Um, for uh, you guys to actually see that this does work, I'm gonna add another form. Name it form two. And I'm gonna make it so the border style is none. So let's see here, uh, sizable, I want it none. Let's say I want it maximized. And I want it to load up center so it just easily expands. Really that's all I need for this form. Oh, I do wanna make this top most. So make that true. Now for this, under the timer one, I want this to say that me.topmost equals true. Then what we can do is app activate equals, actually we're not gonna get into that. We could, but that's just, you know what? Let's do it. App activate equals whatever the name of your uh, project is so project one. So basically, it's just gonna make sure the app activate. Ooh, let's try this project one. That should work. There we go. And then that's really all that you have to do is me dot topmost equals true. And then in here, under the four one properties. Sometimes my mouse gives out. There we go. We want that to be true just as well. So let's do form two dot show. Then let's do oh another good thing to do is me dot show just as well. This is gonna make sure that we pop up. And then we also want me dot topmost equals true. Then, if you want to, don't have to, but you can add a trigger. So just really quickly, like this is under a millisecond, it's gonna just pow. You know what, but yeah, you can go with that if you guys want. So here we go, this is topmost. And uh, click anything. It's gonna to be topmost, doesn't matter what it is. Nothing can really go over it, which is great. I really hope that you guys enjoy this tutorial and for it not to be as laggy, you may want to kill that switch because you're gonna have, if you wanna have that code, that extra bit right there, you wanna have a high performance computer such as an Alienware. But for the most part do this, you sh it shouldn't be nearly as laggy as what it was to begin with. Uh, that's really all. Another thing that you might want to do is put the app activate in a separate timer. Go ahead and create a new timer. Click on here. Create a new one. I name it for every 1000 milliseconds which is about one second I believe right it will app activate this will keep it from being less laggy just as well so that's great uh, those are some great tips and techniques this is a full demonstration on how to do it really effectively this does get the job done this gets the job done really basic and easily so that's really all for this video 
Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.